Hey, this is PBR51 here with another four-stroke engine update. Now, as you can see, I've uh, done a pretty good amount of stuff to it. So, right off the back, got the nice chain for it. And actually, they didn't have a long enough one with black, so I got the brown one and combined the black and the brown chains together. So, that's why it's not all the same color. But no big deal, it works perfectly. And, uh, what else did I do? Well, I, uh, I added some of these reinforcements along this bar over here, as well as one under there, so that it wouldn't fall apart while I was using it. And I added these two wheels as a flywheel. And, finally, I JB welded this sort of whole top section together, so... It won't come off, and it can withstand the force to uh, that it takes to push down the little valve springs. So, let's see if I can turn this over. You can see now when I turn over this, the gears from uh, this go down and turn over the piston, and as well turning the chain, and thus the camshaft which ultimately moves the rockers which push down the valves kinda of hard to do with one hand see that exhaust valve and intake valve so yeah and it's all perfectly timed uh, between the piston and the camshaft so, that's good. So now, what I decided to do is uh, get one of those uh, Lego Technic electric motors, the little 9-volt ones. And uh, I'm just going to attach that to this through uh, one of these shafts, either the blue one or that one. And uh, see if I can make the engine turn over with that once I get it won't be powered right now under uh, burning actual gasoline it'll just be you know turning over from the the motor so I can see if we actually maybe have some compression or uh, if I can if it actually will uh, yeah you can feel the air coming out of the exhaust but uh basically now all I need to do is order that little motor which I guess you can say it will act as a starter motor, but for now it will just sort of turn everything over so I can see what it sort of needs. Um, what else? Well, and uh, basically I need to also make an ignition source because I don't have anything for ignition yet, which I'm still working on. I mean, that's kind of probably the biggest challenge because Lego doesn't exactly make anything that makes sparks so it's going to be sort of a custom build type thing but um as far as that fuel goes i'm thinking about using uh the what's it called the lighter fluid that comes in a little compressed bottle but uh yeah i didn't jb weld the cylinder head to the cylinder yet you can see moves so you see the valves moving too so yeah it's all perfectly timed so what I need to do basically is just work on the ignition order that motor and uh... sort of see how it is with that motor so uh... Yep. I'll let you know when I order the motor and uh, make a video once I get it. But, yep, so see you guys later.